All right, as promised, my feathery friends. Look, I got you two buckets of food, all right? Whoa! <laughs> Hi, bucket. <laughs> Speaking of, bucket. Look at that bucket. Golly, she's hungry. Yeah, you get your food. All right, so we got the chicken coop built. So this week, we're going to build ourselves a chicken run. So we're going to do a high tunnel version of a chicken run. I bought... I hear you. They're ready for it, too. They want to get out. Um because it's been about two days they've been cooped up in their coop. So with the chicken run, I bought cattle panels. So I'm gonna do three cattle panels in width long. So it's gonna be about 12 feet long and hopefully we'll finish before it snows, but it shouldn't take too long, I'm hoping. So um, maybe just a day or two because of work and all that. So let's knock this out. Let's move some of this stuff out of the way. Did you come out to see me? I some coffee. <gasps> oh, you brought me some drink? Coffee? Thank you. <laughs> he likes how warm it is. Yeah, it feels good, huh? How's mama doing? Good, how are you? How's that baby in there doing? Good. We're trying to stay warm. It's cold. Yeah, it is. We went to go take the trash out and thought we'd come see you for a minute. Well, I love y'all. Thank you for coming to see me. Yeah, we love you too. <laughs> You're a good boy. You want to see the chickens real quick? Yeah, we'll look at them chickens. Got them in there. Oh, they knocked over their food bowl too. I'm gonna have to get that. They're so messy. Silly chickens. They're so messy. But at least their water's not freezing anymore, so that's yeah. good. Those little perches are really nice. Yeah, they're nice. They? <laughs> He's shutting the door. <laughs> he wants to shut the door. Are you ready to go inside? Are you gonna go inside? I think so. He's making sure they don't escape too. Yeah. That's ice. Yeah, it's ice, baby. It's ice. All right, I love you. Bye bye. Bye bye. bye, -bye. <laughs> Always love it when they come out to visit me. All right, well, my, the wife just came out and told me, she said the door is in, so that's perfect. So our fake eggs came in today. Um, we ordered these off Amazon. Uh, we got the brown eggs, and these are just to help our chickens um, lay more eggs and kind of know where to be laying the eggs in their new nesting boxes. But um, if you can see them right there, they look pretty real. All right, so to distinguish our eggs from the other chicken eggs, we're gonna go ahead and put an X on both ends. Um, this way we can see, no matter what end we're looking at, which one is the fake and which ones are the real. And we're gonna do that to all eight of the ones that we got from Amazon. So we mentioned earlier that we were gonna get a uh, automatic chicken door. So it came in today, Blake went to the PO box. So we got our eggs, we got our automatic door. So now we can get everything set up that I wanted to get set up.
I got these little uh, staples, these smooth shank, hot tip galvanized. So this is what I'm gonna attach this to the wood here to lift it up, because I don't want it to be at the bottom, I want it to be at the top, uh, right above the two by fours. That way I can push it in, lift it up. See here I'm overlapping it and this is to give it some more support in these areas so they're not individually working to fight the snow they're working together to fight the snow along with the structure so they should be able to move very nicely knock all that snow right off of this thing we got to do the chicken plank and finish covering the chicken run with all the six mil plastic three or <laughs> four. I think that'll work just fine. Now let's look at this box here. See what do we have to do to fix this up. Well, it sucks that it wasn't as wide as I thought it was going to be. So instead of a 10 by, it's a 9 by 12, which is kind of tight this way, but extra tall this way, which is okay. I'm super disappointed that. I pre-cut that whole 10 by 10 with that door being 9 by 13 and a half. It's definitely not going to look as good as it should, but that's all right. I guess I'll just roll with the flow. Now, I want to protect them from some of the snow, but I want a little bit to get in there too so they can experience it and understand it. And so I'm going to cover the, the front 10 foot here as a covered protector, and I'm putting my chicken wire across the back here. That way they're protected, and they're protected from some of the snow. That should work just fine. in place. How are y'all doing? Good, how are you? Getting it all put together. Looks good. You gonna bring me my coffee? We had to get a snack. Oh, thank you. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, who's daddy's good he baby? He had to get you a cookie. cookie. He had to take a cookie oh, break. Oh, did you bring daddy a coffee? You wanna give daddy's coffee? Here, I'll hold the, I'll hold this. All right, Harrison, you wanna check out the door? Push it up. Push it. You gotta point it right there. You see where that is? You gotta point it right at it. See, like, press hard. There you go. Whoa! Good job. You wanna peek in there? Go peekaboo. See what you want to do, peekaboo. Hi, chickens. Go boo. Hi, chickens. <laughs> Can you say boo? Oh, he's like, no, gotta shut the door. The nice thing about this what chicken door mean? is that it does come with a little bitty remote, but it will operate based off of time of day and it'll operate based off Whoa. of the sun. So, whether or not there's it's daylight or not. So, when it's should be dark, it should automatically shut. We'll test that out probably later on after I'm finished putting the rest of this up. But uh, all and I have to do is put some chicken wire up and that's it. Yeah, so that way it's, it's locked. That's really nice. Yeah. Got that off Amazon and it wasn't too bad. How much was it? I don't know. It was what like was it? 70, 70 bucks or something. 60 or 70 dollars. So, yeah. I mean, that's a 
Money well spent in our opinion. Yeah, we'll put the link in the description. All right, Daddy's gonna finish up, okay? I gotta knock this out and finish it out. Done, done. Yep. It's locked. 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 You did a good job. It's shut. For not having that many reviews, I think the door turned out pretty good. Nah. Oh yeah, definitely. Nah. Nah. Who are you calling? You calling the chickens? Just watch your daddy. Oh, daddy's gonna block his in. Look. Whoa. <laughs> you can get out that way. Yeah. There you go. Good job. Yay! Woo. Whoa. Okay, close for time. Hammer, hammer. Oh, I hear the airplane. You hear the airplane? Daddy's what daddy's doing. I'm gonna cut this. Whoa. 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 Well, <coughs> good, good job. Good job. <laughs> yep. Yeah, you can do that one too. Look, there's a screw right here. You want to hammer that? Good job, buddy. I like that. Looks good. Looks really good. Oh, you're going to take Daddy the, the screw? Daddy's got a screw for you. Oh, that's so sweet. Oh, thank you for the help again. Oh, big helper, yay! You. Found Daniels, it? Found it, found it! Bam. Good job! Good job! <laughs> Good job, Bubba! Thank you! Say bye-bye! Yeah, <laughs> bye -bye. that's some good living right there, huh? Yeah. All that's right. good living! All right, well, there it is. This is the chicken coop. Yeah, they seem comfortable. Their door's still open. And we got our fake eggs in there, and they already gave us one egg, which was uh, one of our adopted chickens, the bucket. We have her bucket out there, too, in case she wants to do something with that. But here's our chicken run. Looks pretty solid. So this chicken run should at least keep, uh, keep them out of the rain and snow for the most part we're glad it's done too looks nice the entire picture there we go so we got our 12 foot chicken run our eight foot chicken coop so they've been a little reluctant to come out so we're trying to help them and show them how to get out there's their automatic door that's been opening oh, here we go. look hello <laughs> come on out you can do it Come on out. Hi. Don't be scared. Your friends are waiting for you. There you go. Good job. Oh, are they doing it now by themselves? One did, finally. Oh, good. She wasn't scared. <laughs> so after a long, hard day of work, we're going to make some pizza. Yeah, and not only are we making pizza, it's going to be a pumpkin-shaped pizza. So what do you think, Baba? He's already excited. He's Look excited, at him. and he's also going to get to decorate. And it's also a little chilly outside, so this is a good indoor activity, and we can't wait to show you. Right, well, I'll let you start with the dry ingredients, and I'll start cutting open this. What? What? Yeah. Ooh, pizza sauce. Mama's going to let you... The other. Daddy's gonna spice up the pizza sauce. I like some basil and some oregano. Okay, you wanna put it in? Put it in. Good job, buddy. Let's just open this. You wanna taste it? Here, you wanna taste. Here, put. Mm. That's sugar. Yeah. Are you addicted? Okay, you wanna put it in? Oh. <laughs> He's like, I got a taste. Now I got it. Mm -hmm. There we all go. All right. And then for olive oil, we need mm, is that good? two tablespoons. Is that good? So. Here, you want me to do the two yeah, tablespoons? Yeah, you can do the taste. All right. Yeah, you want to try some olive oil? Here. We don't need more sugar, buddy. Mm -hmm. Okay, turn it on. Okay, reach up there. Turn Use it on. Use your stool. There you go. Whoa, wow. good job. All right, we're gonna pour the hot water in now. Here it goes. There we go. 
been fun watching it, buddy. Making our homemade pizza dough. Yeah, let's watch it. Do it. Yeah, there we go. It's kind of mesmerizing. Yeah, it really is. Just turn it this way. I'm gonna turn it the other way. Wait, hold on, we got put some flour on it. All right. Good job yeah, waiting. Yeah. All right, you ready? Good job. Whoa. Roll. Roll in, roll in. Yeah, you're gonna put the sauce on. Yummy. Watch Daddy put the sauce on. Whoa. Whoa. Look at that. Whoa. How's it looking over there, Daddy? Looking real good. Whoa. Good job. He's ready for the cheese part. Yeah, is that cheese good? Can you put the cheese on there? He's too busy eating All it. All right, we're going to put Look, the cheese put the on. Che here, put the cheese on. You going to do it? All right. Ooh, Watch, Daddy. We got lots of extra cheese. We'll make it extra cheesy, huh? Yeah. Right. Look at that cheese. That's the way Daddy would make a pizza right there. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. Mm. I think we're going to yeah. do two eyes and a mouth. Two eyes and a mouth. Yeah, good, good job. Yeah. All right. You want to do another yeah, one? Do another one. Drop it on. Good. Good job. Now we got to put the eyeballs. Look. <gasps> Whoa. You want to put one on? Do it. Oh, you ate his eyeballs. Did you eat it? Oh my goodness, you're so silly. Oh, look at that big old pumpkin smiley face, huh? Look at that pizza, Bubba. Oh, look, Harrison. Look what you made. Look Whoa, that. he's still so happy. Whoa. <laughs> he thinks it's so funny, Daddy. Whoa, 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 whoa. Are whoa. we carving our pumpkin? Whoa. How'd it turn out, Mama? Super good. Super good. Look Cutting at that. some up for little man. Yeah. All right, so this is our homemade pizza. I'm gonna try the crust first. See how the bread turned out? Is it good? It's crunchy. Oh, that's really good. Oh, wow. That's some good crust. The olive oil really helped. And then look how nice and brown it is. Oh, it's perfectly crispy, huh? Mm. All right, let's try the main part. Mmm. <laughs> Is it good? It's supposed to have a good drag when that cheese comes, right? 